Hello, brothers and sisters of the light, fellow star seeds, way showers, light bringers. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, with another message from the Ninth Dimensional Arcturian Council as channeled by Daniel Scranton for December 1st, 2021. And the title of this message is If You Want Open Contact with ETs. And they begin, Greetings, we are the Arcturian Council. We are pleased to connect with all of you. We are awaiting our next big assignment from our Oversoul, as our Oversoul is in direct communication with us at all times, and our Oversoul exists in the 11th dimension. So it has a bigger and better view of what is going on all throughout the universe. We enjoy getting our assignments because we like to be of service. We like to have a mission and a purpose, just like all of you. We suggest that you sit quietly with your eyes closed and enjoy the silence. Enjoy the not doing for a while, and instead of seeing it as a chore to let go of your thoughts, see it as liberating. You get to free yourself from your very active thinking mind for a while as you await some sort of impulse, some sort of instructions that you know are coming from your higher self because of their nature, because of the vibration they hold. You can do this every day. You can do it twice a day or more. You can begin open contact right now with a higher dimensional being known as your higher self. And when you practice being in open contact with a higher dimensional being or collective, you usher in more open contact with physical ET beings of your dimension and of higher dimensions. You don't have to wait till everyone is ready. You don't have to wait till some government official discloses the truth about ETs and humans. You can begin your contact experiences by starting with your very own higher self-consciousness. Now, when we say higher self-consciousness, because you are not separate from your higher self, you are one and the same, but it's an aspect of you that's operating from a higher dimensional plane, a higher level of consciousness, and the personal ET encounters that you will have or that you have been having are with beings that are other aspects of you. That's the best place to start with ET contact. You're seeing you no matter whom you are meeting. It's always you. It's always another aspect of you. And yes, there are closer relationships. There are those with whom you share an oversoul. And there are twin souls. And there are beings that you've connected with over and over again, and they seem like they are more you than some being you've never met before. But truly, it's all you. And so, if you want more contact with other aspects of you that come to you in the form of ETs, start by having more contact with you, right here and right now. Be in contact with yourself, your thoughts, your feelings, your vibration, the things you believe and the things you know. Get in touch with your own heart, with your own love, with your own vibrational signature. That's a good place to start if you want contact with more of you. Start with you and you'll always get more in this universe. Looking outside of yourself without that knowing will always have you looking outside of yourself because ultimately everything is meant to get you to look within and when you do, you are certain to find what you are looking for every time. We are the Arcturian Council and we have enjoyed connecting with you. Once again, another marvelous instructional and inspirational message from the Ninth Dimensional Arcturian Council as channeled by Daniel Scranton. His website is danielscranton.com. I will be able to post the words to this message below in the show more section. And you can also always find Daniel's fine work on the Sananda website or voyagesoflight.blogspot.com. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light. And it's always my honor and pleasure to bring these wonderful messages to all of you. Mm -hmm.